1,500 metres today, but gets preferred conditions and a massive dropping grade down from Group 1 company down to listed. And maybe this is where he is more suited. OK, let's go to the call. The Tattersalls Mile, race number seven at Eagle Farm with David Fowler. Eagle Mod about to go in. The 1,600 metre ambassador, Brett West, has given his all clear, so we're just about ready to see them go. Starters at the ladder. Maracana goes up, ready to jump. Lights on. All set for the Tattersall's mile. I know a star expected to go forward. Racing. Oh, a starter's delight. They bounced as one. Where's I know a star? Was one of the first to go, but there's a bit of speed inside of it. Jenny and Mississippi Prince are flying through, so is Connie. They've got the favourite. Three and four wide in fourth early. Cepheus landing fifth in the rail, then Coco Brew Express, followed by Whopper T, and then came Charterhouse and Mara Carter. New mandate, Jimmy Hendricks, and no speed from Eaglemont, three lengths away last. Jenny's the leader, and there's no lead for another star. He has to park outside of Jenny. Coco Brew Express doing a tough three white. Connie getting a tidy runner, and so is Mississippi Prince over on the rail. Followed then by Mara Carter, who's the three wide at that backbender. Over on the inside was Whopper T, and then came Cepheus. Two lengths away to Charterhouse, a length of New Man. Mandate, two to Jimmy Hendricks and two to Eagle Mod. Last at the halfway mark, 10 off the lead. It's Sajetti in front from I Know a Star the outside. Coco Brew Express three wide. Mississippi Prince fourth the rail in the centre. Cotty couldn't have wished for a better trip as they go by the 600. Mara Carter three wide with cover. Cepheus starts to travel into the picture. Then Whopper T, a long way back, Charterhouse. Third last at the bend and then came... Well back on straightening, new mandate with Jimi Hendrix and Eagle Modders last of all, but the favourite drove to a clear lead. That's I know a star. Dashed away. Connie comes after it gamely. Mara Carter's running on pretty well. And then came Cepheus. How much gas in the tank with I know a star? Connie's edging into the margin. Then Mara Carter and Cepheus. I know a star in front. Connie might have it. Connie on the outside raced up, hit the lead and won. Connie beat I know a star. Photo third, Mara Carter or Cepheus. Wider was Charterhouse, near the inside Whopper T, then New Mandate, followed by Eagle Mod, Coco Brew Express, Mississippi Prince and Jenny last home. Connie the winner. Result here in Queensland with Mark Curry and Angela Jones teaming up with Cotty. The nice price as well. It wasn't really exactly how we imagined the race would pan out, Lizzie. With I Know A Star not getting any favours in front, finally getting to lead him up on the bend. But Cotty, too much petrol in the tank come the end of this race. 53 kilos on the back, all the difference. Yeah, she's a, quite a nice mare in the making. She's got really nice form leading into this last start performance and I just think she's a bit more of the fresher conveyance over a horse like I know a star who's had plenty of racing on its side but a really nice for Ange Jones back-to-back -back feature wins at each weekend she's riding stacks of winners she was able to uh, take out the Ipswich Cup last week